investigating for you. This is Tucson Today, live. Good morning, welcome back. I'm John Overall. And I'm Nicole Semery. Thank you for joining us. All developing this morning, the New York City police officer who was shot in the head last weekend has died. Officer Brian Moore was in a medically induced coma after undergoing brain surgery for his injuries. Demetrius Blackwell, who's accused of shooting Moore, now faces charges of murder in the first degree. Also developing this morning on the Phoenix men killed outside a Texas cartoon contest. Investigators say Elton Simpson declared his allegiance to ISIS on Twitter just before he and his roommate Nadir Sufi allegedly opened fire on a security guard outside a venue hosting a contest for cartoons of the Prophet Muhammad. Simpson and Sufi were both shot and killed by police. The security guard was wounded, but he'll be okay. Simpson had been under FBI investigation since 2006. You know, you can find a whole lot of great deals on the internet, but there's also a lot of scammers out there fishing for victims. That's exactly what happened to a local woman. News 4 Tucson Sean Mooney has tips to keep you safe while dealing on the web. It's a multi-million dollar industry profiting from those most vulnerable in desperate situations and in need of money. I text him at one point and ask him, is this a scam? Uh, and he texts me back and he goes, no, I'm a reverend. Oh, and that seemed to make it okay. Patricia Pritchett had to move. She needed cash to do it. She tried selling household items on Craigslist, including a heating and cooling unit. Within days, she had a buyer, or so she thought. Um, the check was for $2,100, uh, $650 for my cooler, um, $1,450 for um, shipping and handling. And um, he wanted me to withdraw the cash from my checking account and um, take it to an ace check cashing place 